Hey guys, what's up? Exo Vendetta here. Today I'm doing one of these phones you would probably either call off brand or foreign, which it is foreign actually, so that would be pretty accurate. But I wanted to try a phone unboxing and I thought I'd try a random one, not one that you guys would know, like Galaxy or something. I wanted to do a random one. So, yes, I looked for a phone that was unknown and unheard of. I don't know if you guys ever heard of it, but this is the Juning Android phone. Yeah, Juning. I think it's from China, if I'm correct. Now, let's see how bad this thing is, or good this thing is. We're going to find out now. Uh, the box is good, you know, so that way if you drop it, it won't break. Okay, that's good. Alright, first off, it comes right there on the front. There you go, the phone. It comes in bubble wrap, all by itself. That's all nice. Oh, wow, it's really warm. Well, it was outside for a long time. Uh, note, please remove the black, uh, the backside yellow film of the battery before you, uh, charging. Before you charging. Not before you're charging, before you charging. Because when it's from another country, grammar doesn't matter. Okay, first off, I'm going to take off this little lens that explains where all the home button is and all that. And there we go. Okay. So... First off and foremost, I want to try to figure out how to get the yellow stuff off the back. And can I even turn this on? I wonder. Um, uh, I think I can get this off. Yeah, there we go. That's how. You, yeah, it's just a peel off back. Okay. Yep. <clears throat> there we go. Alright, so that's pretty much what the inside of it looks like, and there is a, where a SIM card can go into, it's dual SIM card. Oh, wow, you can put two uh, 32 gigabytes in there and have enough space. Nice, okay, uh, can I take this off? I don't see the yellow sticker at all, so I don't know what I'm supposed to be looking for, to be honest. Uh, hmm, that's weird. But it says before charging, not before turning on. So I'm going to put this back until I figure all that out. And I'm just going to turn it on and see how it goes. And by the way, if you want the link to this, guys, I didn't tell you in the last video, but the link is in the description if you guys wanted to know more about that um, uh, tablet, the Amazon tablet. You can find it on Amazon. I'll put the link in the description. I'll put the link to this in the description so that way if you guys want you can just mosey on down to Amazon and pick it up yourself it's cheap you're not gonna be out of money it's only like 72 bucks with free shipping if you get it from the right retailer um alright so I think this is the volume button you can tell kind of in a way because this button you can't even tell but th this button's smaller than this one this one's longer so I'm assuming that this one's for up and down volume uh, let's try to turn it on. Let's see. I noticed also that the, um, okay, well, I guess it needs to charge. Well, then we're going to have to wait until it charges because if you can tell, it's not doing anything. So, yeah. All right, guys. Well, until it's charged, I'll see you in just a sec. Oh, and by the way, one more thing before it does charge, I wanted to show you the charger and the headphones and everything else that comes in it. Here is the headphones. Yeah, those normal bud ones that Apple has that no one really cares about. Yeah, they're kind of like those. Well, my girl has her own anime looking pair, so it really don't matter. But she can use those on the side if she wants. This is the head of the charger. Let's just get that out there. It says Juning on it, like it's branded. It's just a uh, charger. And um, this is the cord, obviously, that you use to connect to the head to plug it into the wall. Or if you want, you can plug this up to a PS4, PC, laptop, whatever you want. But uh, yeah, it's just a normal USB with a flathead charger. <clears throat> now, uh, before we get into this, also, normally phones don't do this that I've ever seen, but this comes with a case. Yeah, a case. <laughs> it, uh, it's a gel case. It's clear. Um, it's nothing special, but it's just nice that they come with a case because normally a lot of phone companies don't do that. So I think it's pretty cool that it did. Um, but anyways, that's it. That's in the box, guys. I'm going to put this on the charger now and I'll see you in a bit. Peace. Hey guys, back again. Now it charged up. It's only like on 30 something percent, 
but I just wanted to show you what it looks like when it turns on. It already comes with a screen protector as well, which is another thing that doesn't, that's really not popular with a lot of high-end phones like, you know, Samsung or Apple, HTC. A lot of them that I've seen never do that. So that's pretty nice that it comes with a little glossy gel case. And then at the same time, a uh, screen protector. But anyways, this is what it looks like when it comes on. It's white. It says welcome. I don't know if you can see that. That's what it sounds like. I know it's so bright. I need that damn new camera. That's gonna be the next unboxing. Watch that get the most likes too. Oh, finally, no more shit video. It says welcome. And it's still a long intro. Just give it a minute. There we go. This is what it looks like. It's gold. It shows the uh, time and date on the on the top. Maybe if I darken the screen a little bit. Hold on. See? There you go. And it says swipe up to unlock. Okay, so we're swiping up. And let's see. This is what it looks like logging in. Oh, I hit the power button on accident. Okay, there. Ooh. Alright, so that's what it looks like. It's really fast, to be honest with you. Uh, the apps that are installed is basic. WeChat, Facebook, Calculator, Clock, Contacts. Uh, yeah. <laughs> that's it. Um, What can I say? There's gallery settings, camera, email, yeah, pretty much. Apps, okay, so here's the apps. Um, pretty basic, there's a torch for light, all that good stuff, all that fuckery, look at all of that on there. Ugh, all of that. Um, yes, it has Play Store, by the way, just to answer anybody's question, there it is, in the top right corner, in your right corner, yep, yep. It would be my right, too, because it's on this side, and this is my right hand, but just saying top right. Um, so, yeah, there you go. It already has uh, WhatsApp, Voice Search, basic apps. You know, I'm not going to name them all off again. But, anyway, it can have dual SIM cards, and, uh, yeah, it just turned off. And uh, the phone's really big, and um, now I'm going to probably see if I can test out the sound quality. What can I look up? Okay. How about we... Um, I'm going to go to browser. Okay. I'm just going to type in uh, YouTube. Let's... Uh, YouTube... Enter. Oh, internet. I need to connect to internet. Um, well, how about we just record a video and take a picture and see what that looks like. Hmm, probably be posting up on with this phone too to see the picture quality. Where is the camera? There it is. Alright, I'm about to take a selfie. Whoa. Reverse. Hold on, guys. Oh, God, I look ugly. Alright, cool. So I took a photo. Yep. There's my ugly face. It's pretty nice, to be honest. Uh, it doesn't look that bright. But, um, to be honest, the quality is pretty clear. It's not stashy looking or like that at like um what do you call it yeah it's nothing like that it's actually very clear it takes a picture kind of like an iphone but picture the filter always kind of like a darker shade um like you're under a light or something yeah um but it's not bad though i mean it's really not all right so this is the camera quality now let me see if i can't just you know 
go back now. There. Um. Ooh, that, that camera's not keeping up really good. Hello, hey guys, what's up? Exo here. Now I'm recording from two different phones. I think I'll stick with my iPhone though, because I think the picture quality is really much better than the uh, camera. But um, other than that, the camera is nice too. I'm just saying it's like um, it's kind of like uh, just a little bit. All right, I'm saving that. I'm gonna see what it looks like now. Um, well, hear what it looks like. All right, is this turned up all the way? Yes, it is. Hello, hey guys, what's up? Exo here. Now I'm recording from two different phones. I think I'll stick with my iPhone though, because I think the picture quality is really much better than the uh, camera. But um, other than that, the camera is nice too. I'm just saying, it's like um, it's kind of like. Uh, Okay, well it's kind of like, uh, it's kind of decent. It's good. It's good if you want to record something really quick. But for it to keep up with somebody running or something or moving around a lot, it may be a little blurry. It's like one of those uh, cameras that uh, people use at school when there's a fight. And then when you see the video thing, it's going to be something like World Star. The camera's always shit. <laughs> it's like that, but it's not shit. It's still decent. Um, so far, that's really all I've got to say about it. It's pretty nice. The camera, picture, good. It's dual SIM card. Um, it's on, uh, I can't tell the percentage. It just shows the bar. But I'm pretty sure you can go to settings and where it shows the percentage. Change that. Um, I'm going to connect this to internet and I'm going to play with it a little bit. And then I might do an update review on this. So stay tuned, guys. And leave a like if you would like me to uh, make another review on this after a few weeks or a week or two of having it. All right, guys. Well, that's it for now. I hope you guys enjoyed. Twitter, Instagram links in the description below. As always, XO.